plan. Now all I need is planning permission. Oh my god, did you hear they ban makeup at school now too? Even people in prison are allowed to wear makeup and they're like mostly criminals except for my cousin Tiffany J from Mika Huna who's just in the wrong place at the wrong time. My uniform design definitely includes makeup. Hashtag be your own hero. Don't let anything stop you. Because nothing's going to stop me. No. Was that a yo? No, that was a no, yo. But can any loser enter the uniform competition? You got no design skills, no fan base, and no street cred. Be that as it may, I need to make a public point. After your little protest thing, the principal will not be down with double L in the mix. That's a shame, cos my design was going to be based off my favourite teacher's wardrobe. Go on. Featuring a fresh twist on late 80s hip-hop. Even though I know you're lying, I'm going to let you in. Lucy FTW. That's for the win, right? Yeah. I knew that. <clears throat> I knew that, yo. <laughs> Kieto, umere. Right. One of the designs you see today will become Hills High's new uniform. <laughs> Obviously, it'll be refined by professionals who may or may not change the design entirely. <laughs> so, on with the show. So basically. It's Kate Middleton's sophisticacy with Pippa Middleton's casualization. Some of us sit down a lot, so I'm saying pants. High-waisted, padded pants. One word. Robes. Expelliarmus! <laughs> Two words. Gender neutral. The uniform should be so awesome that any kids that come here go, wow, my uniform is so awesome. I'm going to learn such awesome stuff wearing this awesome uniform because Holly Hills High, it's so awesome! With optional cuff of this and snood. <laughs> There's nothing more classic than a plain white t-shirt. And this one has a hidden feature that I think you'll like. <laughs> <laughs> now everyone can be best dressed. <laughs> This is the dumbest idea in the world. Maybe you're right, Rubes. I usually am. Nah, man, you're Lucy Lewis. You stood up to the scariest girl in school. Yeah. You got Lila and Ala to wear polyester. I guess. And you let Mr Kinlock let you do this, even though you're, like, nowhere near prepared. I did, didn't I? <laughs> BT Dubs, J.S. may or may not have mentioned you in her pitch. Was she nice? Oh, she was not. Oh. Well, thanks for letting me do this, Mr K. You're a good teacher. Don't let the fact that you're a whack public speaker make you nervous. Thanks. Or that the principal will probably suspend you if she doesn't like what she sees. Again, thanks. You ready? In no way, shape or form. <clears throat> <sighs> Oof, tough crowd. Almost done, peeps. Up next is Lucy Lewis. Yeah! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, <coughs> Don't wet your pants, loser. <laughs> My uniform idea is kind of hard to explain. Then don't bother. <laughs> it, it might just be easier if I just show you. My uniform proposal is no uniform. Basically, just wear what you're comfortable in, just like before. I like that it celebrates my individuality. I like that it makes me responsible for not being distracted by girls, female closing attire. So we can wear what we want? Yep. Including, but not limited to, short skirts, sweaty straps and leggings. That's the idea. Does this freedom exceed to make-up usage? 
This is all very amusing, but you're not going to save the day with one of your speeches this time, Miss Lewis. So, if that's everyone... I'm not finished. I know my uniform design can't win. You think? Because uniforms at Hills High are unconstitutional, according to the school constitution. Excuse me? This book sums it up nicely. Hills High is a place of learning, not of learning to wear the same pantaloons as everyone else. Uniforms are henceforth forever banned at Hills High. Who wants to look like those uniform sheep at Valley High anyway? That last bit is less relevant. This is ridiculous. Can't go against our perfectly normal founders, can we? And that is how losers don't lose. No hard feelings about the pee photo, eh? Um, yes, hard feelings. It was just a joke. It was all supposed to be a joke. <laughs> Good one. By the way, I'm quitting as your tutor. No joke. You can't. I mean, you can't. Mr. Kinglock just told me that I got my highest mark since you started helping me. Really? I mean, so? You're a bully and I don't help bullies. Actually thinking of stopping the whole Instagram thing. Now it's gone mainstream, it's kind of boring. I'll change my mind if you make one more post. <laughs> Check me out on Insta, best dressed. Oh, <laughs> talk about embarrassing. Oh, 13,000 likes. Hashtag crushing it. I have chosen to abide by the constitution of this great school, even though it's outdated and in dire need of review. Therefore, students may dress as they please. For now. So, I guess everything's back to normal. Sort of. I feel oddly confident after doing that show. Same Z. I'm going to go admire my reflection and reflective surfaces. Hey, how's Louise? I'm not into her. She's like obsessed with clothing and curating her Instagram. And she's like oddly symmetrical. What if a decidedly non-symmetrical girl who wasn't obsessed with Instagram or clothes asked you out? Well, uh, I guess I'd say, um... Yep. <laughs> Lucy Lewis for the win. I'm not letting, letting anything stuffing me. Anything. <laughs> <laughs> so, I guess everything's back to my. <laughs> <laughs> 